What's up everybody, peace here today for you guys, welcome back to Last Day on Earth Survival Where we guys, where we gonna be talking about this new uh, upcoming updates that will be coming to Last Day on, uh, on Earth So you guys can, as you already know, um, season 13 just not too long, well ended a good while ago And um, delivery season, so you can see this here is Jake, where we did delivery season uh, So next off there is the laboratory season um, probably that's what is going to be coming um, in the next couple of updates but we're going to pop over here to show the laboratory and um, we're here at, we're at the port location right now and I'm getting a lot of connection issues and really trying to get this video um, really good trying to get this recorded so it's going to really going to take a while um, for me so bear with me guys I know there's going to be a lot of uh, connection loss um, issues but hopefully I can I really want to get this one recorded but it seems like <laughs> the, my Wi-Fi doesn't want me to okay we, we finally got it um but you can see here in the this is the laboratory right here so this is what we're going to be going into hopefully the next couple seasons we're going into it probably won't be the next season but it seems like this seas these seasons are really really big uh upcoming up there so well my connection loss um, comes up again um, I'm right on the discord server so I'll be reading what they have here so let's see it says here survivor, survivors you like to start this week with setting some light on what we're currently working on um, I don't know what to expect in the near future we are happy to see how warm you're welcome the port update and we're going to stop there our plan is to develop and improve the added content so it seems like they'll be adding more content in just of the seasons which we haven't just gotten normal updates um, besides seasons so it seems we'll be getting a more content update rather than seasons I believe in season 12 or so because I've been, I've been playing for a really really long time I've been playing for like season 1 so I've been, I've been like a day one player um, so it seems like they've really been telling uh, really going to start adding some really main content which is going to be really really um happy to see at the end so let's say we're happy to um for the part update and the feedback from you will help us with that there are two big updates prepared at the moment so you see at the moment they're actually talking about really big updates um in season 12 it's if i'm not to right, i believe it's season 12 when or so that the atp was um established which was brought into the game i'm just going to go ahead into here to my blueprints my blueprints here I'll show you guys the ATV because that is the second um, second vehicle we be, be in multiple because the multiple was um, was brought into this season. So I can't find the my ATV. Um, it's back home, but I just want to show you guys the blueprint. Ah, okay, we have it here. So this is the ATV. This was the second um, um, vehicle that came to the game along with Fort Moss, which we can see in 13 or season 12, or, or somewhere around there. Um, Fort Moss is an event that you go to to build like a, like a mini base and protect the front of zombies and it was soup it was one of the most expensive um, seasons but to me it wasn't um, a pretty bad season but it was really tough on free play players um, like myself so let's say there are uh, there are two big updates being prepared at the moment as you already know one of them is going to be dedicated to the crater and the other so when I talk about the crater you may not know what the crater is you say this is the single player map so right now I'll go to you can see the two humans at the bottom uh, right hand corner. I'm gonna hit that and I'm gonna see switch character and I'm gonna switch character and see the port and the crater. So this is where the other update is gonna go to. And the other to the single player zone, which I was just in um not too long ago. So it said the release is scheduled for February and March. That is a that is not too far away from here. So having those really big um, multiplayer updates and single player update is going to really change the game a lot and they're really taking a really big step um, in this game uh, providing with the really big updates and so we're aware that you look forward to every next update and will try to quicken every release as much as possible. Our main goal is to make the game interesting and full of activities um, with the quality level consistently boosting. We hope for you and sign of waiting time and we'd like to thank you for that advice. I almost forgot we had a surprise to entertain you. Meanwhile, we've got an event that's going to be out quite shortly. So it seems we're going to be bringing in a fun little um, update zone probably, like an event zone. 
So you're probably going to loot and find um, some pretty nice loot, hopefully. Uh, for the details on the cupboard, we promise that you will find out everything pretty soon. And so thanks for your attention and support. That is awesome to hear already. So you can see this is the creator. You can see where we go in. You can see the business code right here. And we go in. So this is my shop right here. And you'll be able to sell. So you can see I've sold uh, some planks. I will take my rations. You can see there is coupons and rations as well. So you go here and you can spend the corner falls. That's what you get corner falls to um, upgrade your businesses. And the other, can you can see at the uh, left hand by my health with Peacekeeper, you can see I have coupons and counter falls. And the way you get those, you complete these uh, contracts and be able to get um, different stuff so you can get all of those stuff. You can see shopping, it's telling you to buy um, some stuff. So you can go over here now and actually going to travel. We're going to travel in the uh, metro station and you'll be able to get those kind of falls, able to help you uh, gain, some, gain some new stuff. But there's a picture as well that I'm going to share. I'm not sure if I can share it in the middle of the video. I'm not really not too sure about everything that in. It's going to be pretty uh, weird for me. Um, but I'll try to get that at the end of the video. But to me, I have the video the picture right in front of me. Uh, you can see um, when I talk about the crater, um, it seems like we'll be getting a brand new base. And that'll be telling us. So I'm not so sure if this base is going to be a clan base or it's going to be your base. But you'll be able to build in it and stuff. I wasn't, I'm not really like main YouTuber of Lasting Earth. Um, but I do enjoy recording it and bring it to you guys, even though it's probably new to some of you. But the, if you want to get more in depth on um, this, on um, the creator, uh, the update news, you can go over to Star Snake. I'll probably try to link his, um, his channel in the um, in the comments, or I'll try to link it in the description. But he goes more in depth and show you more of the pictures of these um, to those YouTubers. So you'll be able to build in, in this uh, new area, you'll be able to have a bed, you're going to have. Um, different stuff so they're really trying to change the way you make your bases and it's just having it full of chests and making it just an like, entire loot room and honestly they're really trying to make your base feel like it's home so I really enjoy that they're actually bringing these kind of updates to the game and they really, they really take feedback from, it, from the players I really listen to them um, as well, which is really, really awesome, but I can't wait to see these two updates that are going to be coming um, to last time. Uh, like the creator update, not many people have been really shied away from multiplayer because um, it hasn't been really the, I would say, the bright spark of the game in a sense. Uh, but most people have been so accustomed to single player mode and they've really been, really been taking that under their wing. But to see that they have. This update when the creator brand new location came uh, to the to the game, it really sheds a light on on the game, really bring it into the and they brought into a real good um, situation that they wanted to get in. But to me, I really can't wait uh, to see. I probably won't be able to complete this contract. I'm not gonna really gonna stick around for too much. I just want to show you guys all this stuff. But this is the creator. Um, so really good. I'm really gonna be happy to see um, all of these new new stuff coming to the game. Right? I'm really really excited for sure. I really am um, to see brand new single player updates because we haven't gotten a, a really big content update. And I mean, when I mean content, I didn't mean from a season and that will last for how many other days or a month and then just go away. That's not what I mean. It's from content like permanent content like the new locations um, that have been the single player map, the um, frozen locations, the old locations, um, even the brand new um, swamp locations that came along with Fort Moss and the ATV. So that is a that was a really huge content update bringing a brand new vehicle to the game which would be ATV like I just said. Then the swamp locations which gave you brand new resources in a swamp you got um you got lead ore 
and in the oak locations you got oak, oak trees we return to oak planks to do various upgrades and in swamp locations you'll be able to get ash planks which was which really helped with you helped out in the base so those type of content updates are the updates that I'm really really looking forward to even if they're just normal events you can see here these are the old locations here that came from this watch tower and the frozen locations where the frozen locations give you copper you'll be able to smelt it down to get uh, copper bars and you'll be able to get um, steel so that's really really big uh, content updates that gave you brand new resources to make you progress more into the game. I haven't gotten my ATV. It's pretty tough to um, to craft the ATV as a free to play player because there's there are more than one steps uh, to do that. Uh, you, you need to do bunker marble. So do a lot of the challenges in the game. So the challenge, the first challenge um, in the game was the um, was bunker alpha. You needed bunker alpha to you needed to do like an alpha to get a chopper which was the first vehicle um, added into the game which is right here so you can see the chopper allows you to build a chopper to move faster on the map so you'll be able to, be able to do different variant um, events when you are on that chopper and then, you'll be, and then we got the prison the prison was up in season 10 I probably am going too far down but the, the prison that was a content update from the season which was from season 10 or 11 or something around there so that was season that wasn't really a really main main um, update um, the police station as well that came along and um, then the port which came off of the mobile genesis base which was good and then that's really all of the big main um, those are just main content updates from new vehicles so having the boat now that just came out came along with the port the sand quarry we will get sand and quartz and then when you unlock this um, island watchtower you'll be able to get the dead island um, location and then there's a heli helicopter pad that you won't be able to get to so we will see when you get that I'm not, I don't have it to show you guys I'm sorry but um, pretty tough to get those but this will hopefully be the vehicle that I'll be getting in another season uh, in a big content update hopefully be able to use that to fly over to that location but that's really all i have um for all i can really talk about much on that update doesn't have don't really have much to work on it uh, work on but i think i did pretty pretty well for the um for the most part but i hope you guys did enjoy i hope you guys uh, especially if you burn into the channel i'll try to link snap snipe um video into my um description i'll try to link his channel for you guys if especially if you want to go on um to read about it even happy siri i'll try to get those down if i hopefully don't forget about them but that's really all i have for this if you guys did enjoy it hit that like button if you subscribe here of this video if you not miss any content across my channel especially last day on earth but i hope you guys have an awesome day and peace keep it and i'm out